Long time no see. Today we're going to read The Rainbow Clubhouse. The, chapter 1. The Old Cubby House. Becky looked out her bedroom window into, into the yard next door. The house had been sold to a family from Hong Kong. Today, they were moving in. Becky saw a girl in the yard. Becky opened her bedroom window. Hello, she called out. I'm Becky. The girl looked up and smiled. My name is Suying, she said. Would you like to come to uh, over to my house? Becky smiled back. Okay, she said and ran down the stairs. Mom, Becky said, a new family had moved in next door. Can I go over and meet them? Yes, yeah, said Mom, but just for a little while. Because they will be very busy, I'll come with you. Chapter 2. A new friend. In the corner of the yard was a run, run-down copy house. Becky and Sui Ying went over to the copy. Becky and Su Ying went over to the copy. I never had a little copy house like this before, said Su Ying. In Hong Kong, we didn't even have a garden. We lived in a big apartment building in the middle of the city. We could fix up this copy, said Becky, and turn it into a clubhouse. What is a clubhouse? asked Su Ying. A clubhouse is where you meet your friends and do lots of fun things together, said Becky. I would like to have some new friends, said Su Ying. Just then, Becky called, come on, Becky, it's time to go home. Can Becky come over next Saturday, please? Asked Su Ying. I, we want to clean up the cubby. Yeah, yes, said Mom. If it's all right with your parents, Su Ying's mother smiled. We would like Becky to come over, she said. Chapter 3 Painting the Copy. On Saturday morning, the girls began work on the copy. They cleaned the inside walls and washed the windows. Becky's mom helped too. Mom, said Becky, when all the cleaning was done, do you have any old paints we could use for the outside walls? Sorry, said Mom, you will have to wait until next Saturday when you go to your dad's place. He might have some. Oh no, said Becky. We really want to finish the copy today. Never mind, said Mom. Just then, Su Ying's dad came out of the garage. Come with me, he said. I have some tins of paint you can use. Along the garbage wall, one beside the other, were six small tins of paint. Red, orange, yellow, blue, and purple. All the colors of the rainbow. We could paint the copy like a rainbow, laughed Becky. What a good idea, said Su Ying's dad. I'll help you get started. 
By late Sunday afternoon, the girls had finished painting. They were very tired, but they, but very happy. A cup out looks great," said Becky to Su Ying. "Yes," Su Ying smiled. "I and I know what just what to call it the Rainbow Clubhouse." The end. If you enjoyed this, this. Book the Rainbow Clubhouse. Remember to ring the bell so you don't miss any video, and remember to subscribe to our channel. Bye.